Hey guys, it's Abby, and today, today I have my Snack With Me box, and I'm going to share with you guys what I received in my Snack With Me box. Yes, I'm missing part of my head today, but sometimes my camera just doesn't look right how I have it, and then I like mess with the stuff, and then it chops my head off. So we're just going to deal with the fact that my head is partly chopped off, but it's okay, because it's just the frizz that you guys are missing. You're not missing like much. I mean, my forehead takes up over half my face anyway so if it cuts off part of my forehead so be it I'm all for it um all right so we're gonna do the snack with me box it is $29.99 a month and you get a bunch of snacks like a ton of snacks a lot of freaking snacks like these snacks will last us about two weeks in my house as long as they're like snacks that you can't eat too much of but if it is snacks that you can just eat a whole bag in one sitting it will last us a week we're a family of four, and I have two small children, and they love snacks, so it's a great box for our family. Some of the, I wanted to just touch on this a little bit. Some of the snacks that you get in this box, some of the expiration dates are a little off. So say you get a bag of chips. It might say January 2019 is the expiration date, and I was told that they get this stuff wholesale, and that's why everything's so cheap. But if it's like jerky or... I don't know, something like a meat related thing. I'm a little iffy with trying anything that's expired, but a lot of the stuff isn't expired at all, but there are sometimes you can get expired stuff in there. And I don't know how I feel about, I don't know how I feel about that. To be really super truthful with you guys, I don't know how I feel about expiration dates on like chips or canned goods or candy or stuff like that. I'm, I'm just a little iffy with that. And usually I put that stuff aside and I don't really touch it, but that's a to you guys like I know that I have some canned food in my pantry that is probably expired I haven't used it but I don't know if I would use it I mean if it's green beans I might but I don't really know how I feel about it I'm gonna just think about it a little bit more I've been thinking about it for a few months now and I still have not really eaten the expired stuff that I get from here but as you guys know you guys can make your own decision about what you would want to do with this box anyway it's $29.99 a month and they are the same company that does peaches and petals the mystery mini the pet treater so they're the same company. So I'm going to open this up for you guys and show you guys what I received this month. And it's for February 2019. Right? February? Sure. Here is the box. It is super large and in charge. I'm going to open it up and see what I received. I'm going to put it down on the floor because... Um, I'm going to put it down on the floor because I'm going to. So the first thing I have is this. It's Snack With Me Snack Snack Yum. The most delicious hummus. And... It gives you a recipe to make the most delicious hummus. Don't mind my nails, guys. They're disgusting. I painted my nails, and they looked so cute. But then three days went by, and they're just ridiculous. And I also bite my nails. And if I get anxious, and I took my daughter to the dentist yesterday, and it made me anxious, I just bit all of the nail polish off. They were probably looking at me in the dentist's office like, why is she eating her nail polish? All right. The first two things, three things I'm taking out are the icebreakers mints in cool mint and the expiration on these is February 2019 so these are right at this month we have like four more days until they expire but whatever all right so these are mints I don't think I would be too scared to eat eat mints after the expiration date but um Anyway, so I got three packs of these. It seems like there's a lot in there. And they're also resealable bags. So you can take a mint out and reseal them. I love icebreakers. These are the most powerful mints you can ever eat. So don't eat more than one at a don't time. Don't eat more than one of these at a time because it will bone. It will, <laughs> it will bone. Oh my gosh. These will not bone you. <laughs> these will burn the nose hair off of your nose. So, Okay, the next thing is this. And this is the Al Chipino. And they are... Barbecue Tikka Masala, cholesterol-free, non-GMO, gluten-free, and vegan-friendly. So we got a big bag of these, and the expiration is February 2019 as well. So here we go. These are gluten-free, non-GMO, cooked in sunflower oil, vegan-friendly, nut-free, dairy-free, no trans fat, and cholesterol-free. There's a lot of freeness in there. The next thing are these, and these are Welch's fam Family Farmed Farmer owned crunchy peanut butter snacks. Oh, I don't think I'll ever eat these. I think it's the crunchy part. I like crunchy peanut butter, but I don't think I like crunchy peanut butter balls. So anyway, there's jelly inside these. I think I'll let Scarlett try these. She likes peanut butter and jelly. 
So the next thing is this, and this is the min the mini chocolate tone chocolate chips moist and fresh. Oh, these are really good. I got some of these in my degusta box, and um, I got like the fruit one, and I ate both of them. I got two of them. I ate both of them in one sitting. So I'm excited to eat these. It's like a these are like the little fruit cakes that you eat during the holidays, but this one is chocolate chip. And yes, ma'am, I will eat this. I will definitely eat this. Um, and the expiration for this is. July 31st, 2019. So we're good with that. Next thing is this. This is another Al Chipino. And these are the Try a New Angle Peri Peri. I don't know what that is, but here we go. And these are February 2019 as well. So, all right. I don't know what Peri Peri is, but I'll definitely try them. I like chips. I'll eat those. Um, the next thing is this. This is late July snacks. These are sea salt multigrain tortilla chips. And there's chia, quinoa, millet, amaranth, flax, and lin. I don't know what that is. These are gluten-free, vegan, and they're also kosher. And also the expiration is February 20, 2019 for this one as well. So everything is expiring this month. And we have like four days to eat this. Here is another icebreakers. I'm excited. Here is an agor... These are the Annie's Homegrown Certified Organic Chocolate Chip Cookie Bites. And I love getting the Annie's Homegrown stuff. They're so good. And they're like clean snacks for my kids. And my kids really like this company. Um, and these are as well for February 2019. The next is this. And this is the Athena Baked Pita Chips. These are so good. I don't know if you guys have ever tried these. But these are so good. And this is the roasted garlic and herb. And let me tell you, these are so, I'm going to keep saying it. These are so good. We actually got that little card that gave you the recipe and these were on the card. So I'm so excited about these because I buy these all the time and I love hummus. I actually was brought up saying hummus, but now that I'm older and for some reason I say hummus all the time. But anyway, these are so delicious. And good through March 2019. I'm so excited about these. These will not, not last through March. I will eat these. I will eat them. All right, the next thing are these Snyder's gluten-free pretzels in hot buffalo wing. I don't know if I'll eat these. These are good through March 2019. And I don't know if I'll eat these because they're buffalo wing ones and I'm not that big on spice, but I'll definitely try them. And if I don't like them, I'll give them to my sister. She'll eat them. So here they are. I love Snyder's pretzels. And I also like, I love the hard pretzels. I love the honey mustard ones of these. These are good. Okay, the next thing is this. This is Sather's Sour Neon Night Crawlers. These are the, um, what are these? Gummy worms. These are sour gummy worms, and I love these so much. I might have to hide these for my kids, especially Scarlet, because she just had dental work. So I'll just eat these for myself. These are good through July 2019. So these are good to go, and that's a nice bag of gummy worms. Yes, ma'am. All right, the next thing are these, and these are the caramel apple filled milk chocolates by Hershey's. I've never tried these. I'm a little nervous to try them because it just sounds weird, but I do like caramel apples, so I'll totally try them. And these are good through July 2019. So here we go, we got a big bag of the caramel apple ones. I wonder if these are good. Should I try one? Let's try one. So they look like little apples. Oh, that's so cute. And let's eat one. I'm just nervous because I've never tried chocolate that tastes like apple. Okay. They're not bad. You don't taste much of the apple. You taste more of the chocolate than the apple, but those are good. Those are really good. I thought they would be more of like an artificial apple taste, but I just tasted mostly milk chocolate and maybe just a tiny hint of apple, but a lot of the caramel. They actually made my mouth water so much. Do you ever eat something and your mouth will not stop watering? That's what's happening right now. Is this? And this is just a big bag full of Reese's peanut butter cups. Like, they're just bags, little tiny Reese's peanut butter cups. Well, they're not tiny, but they're like little individual Reese's peanut butter cups. And these are good through February 
I think these are all good through February 2019. Yeah, so all of them have like a February 2019. And with these, you have to like really open them up and see if they're still good because you'll be able to tell if they're still good by the way that the peanut butter is. And let me, let me break one open and I'll tell you. So here it is. Sometimes if the peanut butter is, if they're old, the peanut butter will taste like dry. That's really good. And they're still good. And the last but not least is by Stella Doro. And these are cookies. They're Lady Stella cookies. And these are good through April. So we got a big thing of cookies. All right, guys. So what did you think about this box? I think that this box was really good. We got a lot of sweet stuff, and I love sweet, but we also got a lot of salty as well. We got cookies and lots of different chips to try, as well as these. We got these chips to try, and these are the barbecue tikka masala. We got the chocolate organic cookie bites. We got a panettone. We got the hot buffalo wing pretzel bites. We got these, which I think I'm most excited about this. We got the crunchy peanut butter balls, which my kids will try. We got lots of bags of the icebreakers, the mints, which everyone could use a mint, so I'm excited about these. We got a bag of the Reese's peanut butter cups, which, yes ma'am. We got a bag of the Hershey's caramel apple bites or chocolates, and these are actually really good. I was surprised. And we got some of the gummy worms. So I think that is, I thought this was a great box. I'm gonna have to hide most of this from my kids because it is so sweet. And I'll give them like, you know, during the, we, I'm not, I don't give my kids sugar on the weekdays because of school. So I'll let them have like a few treats in during the weekend. But I thought it was a great, great box. I love this box. I think that it's such a good box. For $29.99, you get so much stuff, and this will last me quite a while. So I'll make sure to link my link in my description box below so you can go check it out for yourselves. And I think that's it for today. Let me know if you thought this box was good. Do you get this box? If you do, what did you get this month? Did we all get the same things? And I hope everyone's having a really great day. Thank you so much for watching this video. I love you guys so very much. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.